Hello everyone, today we're going to look at Yusako training barn repair. For this problem, we're given S dolls and exactly C of those S dolls have cows in them. And we're given the stall numbers for those. And then we're supposed to basically repair the barn, meaning that we're supposed to place um, boards in front of the stalls that have cows in them. And then we're given M boards that can be purchased, or M boards that we can be using to block. And we're finding the minimum number of stalls that must be blocked. Okay, so for this case, we're given 50 stalls, and 18 of those stalls, which is, which is 3, 4, 6, blah, 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 are, have cows in them. And we're given 4 boards to block them. Okay, so the best arrangement would to be having a board block from 3 to 8, one, another one from 14 to 21, another one from 25 to 31, and the last one from 40 to 43. And since um, these dolls would add up to 25, which is our best answer. Okay. So for this problem, let's just write out all these saws have that have been occupied. So we have three, we have four, six, eight, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, twenty-one, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven. 30, 31, 40, 41, 42, 43. Okay, so our best arrangement was to be having a board from 3 to 8, 14 to 21, 25 to 31, and 40 to 43. Okay, so one way is that we can actually have, um, we can write out all the differences in between the occupied stall or the number of stalls in between those. So over here we have zero, since um, three and four are adjacent. Here we have one, we have one, two, here we have five, zero, zero, zero. We have three, three as well, zero, zero, two, zero. We have eight, zero, zero, and zero. Okay, so for here, we can actually mark out, um, here you can notice that, for for example, here is the start of the um, first, first board, I mean the end of the first board, and here is the start of the second board. So you can notice that 5, 3, and 8 are the three largest, um, three largest boards. Okay, so for these, you can actually um, see that um, basically it is always the best to to um, to leave out more boards since we're uh, we're calculating the minimum number of stalls to be blocked. Okay, so we can actually do some um, com complementary counting. So over here, you can say that we start off with. We start off with S dolls, which in this case we have fifty. Okay. And here, um, we're given M blocks, which is in this case it is four. So you can notice that, um, over here, over here, and over here, there are exactly M minus one, um, uh, M minus one like gaps for us to leave out. So. To do this, the best way would to have, would to like subtract the m minus one largest gaps. So in this case, this would be eight, three, and five. Okay, so we start off with fifty, and then you subtract eight, subtract three, and subtract five, and we would be left with thirty-four. But our answer is actually twenty-five. So how do we get there? 
you can notice that actually um, from stalls from 1 to 2 and the stalls from um, 44 to 50 are not blocked since we did not include them in these so are you, so we can just subtract them since we're not blocking them and we're doing some complementary counting so from 1 to 2 this would be 2 stalls so so minus 2 and then from 44 to 50 we would, you would have um 7 stalls so here minus 9 this would give us 25 which is our answer okay so when um when you're coding you can just keep track first find the differences between the every single adjacent stall and then you take the um you take the uh, you subtract um the n minus one largest gaps from 50 which is s and at the end you just subtract the beginning gap and the end gap okay let's get to coding Okay, so in this case we're given, okay, just include this. Okay, so we're reading, this problem is called um, barn1.in, and writing to barn1.out. Okay, so we're given M, S, and C. So I can read them here. Okay, so we're given, um, okay, we can use a vector to store the occupied stall. So this would be, let's just say, S, small s. So there are exactly, um, C stalls that have been occupied, and we have to read them, so we can just read them. You can just read a temporary one and then you would just push back your T. So now we need to calculate the differences. So I so you can just do this. Um, okay, so it, there would be exactly a C C minus one differences. And then your you could just keep track of this. Um it would be basically the next one minus the current one. So then you wouldn't like double count or anything. So over here, um, actually for our last element, um, we have nothing to compare it with, so we can just we can just remove it. Okay. So now we need to store our uh, our vector, so we can store over here. We would do uh, s star r begin since we're sorting it from large to small. So now uh, we should have a variable to keep track of our answer. And originally we would have s dolls. Okay. So over here, um, actually we should first um sort our sort our um stalls that have been occupied, so we can have a um and like correct difference over here. So you would just sort it. Okay. So now we need to subtract the first m minus one, uh, m minus one uh gaps. So it would be, it would be four and m minus one i plus plus, and then your answer just subtract the s of i. And over here, for example, if if um s of i was one was four and this is three, this was this should actually be zero, so we just need to subtract one from this as well. Okay, so now we actually have to subtract the gap in the very beginning and the very end. So we can do this actually over here. Okay, so your first element would be, so okay, so for example, if um, if your first before or actually your, your first stall that was occupied it was three then you would have one two that are missing so you can go like this so we can actually define our answer over here so your answer be equal to your you would subtract the very beginning gap which would be s of zero minus one 
and then you would also subtract it from the end. So let's just say for the sample, our S is 50 and our, and our last element is 43. And this would be 7, which is 50 minus 43. So your answer would also subtract S minus S of back. Okay, so now all we're left to do is just to print our answer. It's actually F out. Okay, I'm just going to copy the input. Actually, it's over here. I'm just going to run it again. Okay, looks like it is compiling. It looks like I, actually, I accidentally put F in, I mean C in, which then shouldn't work because I'm supposed to give the input, which I isn't, since it's in the file. Okay, so it's like it is 25, and I'm just going to try to submit it to make sure. So my ID is down to 3. This problem is um, barn 1. And the language is C plus plus eleven. Okay, let's go to the problem. Okay, this is called barn repair. So here we go. Okay, so it looks like it says. I'm printing a negative answer. Okay, so it looks like. Okay, so I did sort it. Okay, so we can actually just test it on our side. Okay, so here, let's go to our. Or s to begin, s to end. Okay. okay, so I copied the input. I'm just going to run it. Okay, so it, I am getting a negative answer. So we can do some debugging here. Okay, so over here we can just first print out the, um, the sorted vector. It should be sorted. You could just I'm just going to use standard, so it'd be S of I. Okay, so over here, I just need to run it. Okay, so it looks like that is start sorted. Okay, so it looks like. So we're given M, S, and C. Okay, so M, S, and C. Okay, so we can actually just print our answer. So we can go like, answer is what it is right now. So we can actually first remove this since we're done debugging that. Okay, so our answer after this, after subtracting the begin and end should be 190, which looks like it is right. Okay, so we're given 50 blocks, which is over our, um, 50 blocks, which is like over our, um, our number of, our number of, like, how do you say this, like, our number of, like, Occupy saw. So over here, since that is this is actually greater than a size, we could we can go min this because we don't actually have to use that many um blocks since since we only have twenty I mean ten 
stars that have cows in them, but we have 50, um, 50 boards. So we can go min this and C. Actually, C minus 1. Okay, so we can actually remove this. So 10, which, let me check, okay, which is 10, okay, so I'm just going to submit it again, okay, it looks like that is right, um, so if you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section below, bye.